Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to enable or disable the arrow effect in Windows Vista. Arrow is Microsoft's way of adding a little more uh, touch to the way Windows open and close and look in Windows. So I'm going to show you here how to enable and disable that effect. You might want to enable or disable it because it uses a lot more processing power than normal Windows would. Begin by right clicking on your desktop and go to personalize. This pulls up the personalization options for Windows Vista. The one that we're interested in is the very first one, window color and appearance. This opens up the window color and appearance dialog, but we want to see this little bitty link down here at the bottom that says open classic appearance properties for more color options. Click on that. This opens a dialog that has, as you can see, color schemes. Windows arrow is the one that is selected. To turn Windows Arrow off, you can go for Windows Vista Basic and press Apply. That will take uh, about two or three seconds for it to adjust. And I've just turned off Arrow. If I minimize this window, you'll see it'll just jump away. It won't uh, fade away or slide down to the bottom. It just jumps. To turn it back on, you want to go select Windows Arrow again and just press Apply. Now Windows Arrow is now enabled. If I will minimize this window now, you'll see the difference. Notice how it faded away and just slid towards the bottom very gracefully. If you want to really go for performance in your computer, you can select Windows Classic. A lot of people think of this as not a very good looking uh, look, but as far as performance goes, uh, it gives you the best performance. Everything's a little more blocky, but it renders a lot faster. This dialog is a very easy tool for allowing you to speed up your uh, Windows desktop. My name is Dave Andrews and I've just showed you how to disable and enable Windows Arrow effects in Microsoft Vista.